I'm gonna be using a few black up products today. I don't have enough to do an entire face, just black up products. So most of the products are from black up. It's gonna be like a full face featuring black up products. So this is their primer, the base, the SPF 25 protective primer, really cute little packaging. I'm just gonna take some, squeeze it back in my hand and apply this to my T-zone areas. Quite a liquidy primer. I doubt this really helps with oil control, to be honest. But we'll see how this wears. Yeah, I, it feels it feels quite oily. I don't think this is meant to be a like a mattifying primer. So I am going to apply my actual primer. I'm going to use the Becca Ever Matte Pore Perfecting Primer. That feels so much better. For my foundation, I'm going to use the Black Up Mattifying Fluid Foundation, and this is the shade 12. Just going to use a damp beauty blender to apply it. For primer, I'm going to use the Urban Decay Primer Potion to prime my lids. Just setting my brow bone area and a little bit of my lids just so there's no shininess when I apply my shadows. From the Nubian 2 palette, I'm going to take Morocco, which is a matte orange shade. You know, I love orange for my as a transition color. No, I just feel like it really complements. It's just really, it's just a really good um, transition shade. For my brow bone highlight, I'm going to go in with Nairobi, which is a gold shade. I'm going to use that as my brow bone highlight. It's also a good way to kind of give your brows a more defined feel because it highlights that area. So if I was to move from my original spot, I will lose focus. I'm just hoping I'm in focus right now. I can't tell. Because my lids crease a lot, as you can see, I'm just gonna use, I'm gonna use my brow gel thingy to apply to my lids. Just going to help to reduce the creasing and also kind of give my lids the illusion of a bigger lid space. I'm gonna apply Jezebel, which is like a cranberry purple right shade. I'm just going to apply this all over my lid and just blend that into the crease. And then go over it with the dark brown shade which is this one. This is called Kenya. So it should look something like this. Now the star of the show is this pencil by Black Up and this is their smoky waterproof pencil and this is the shade, they actually don't have num they don't have names, they just have, I think they just have numbers. I'm gonna apply this as like a liner to my lash line. We are also going to do a wing as well. I'm going to do that after I apply my lashes, just so I know where to place it and how high to place it. My lashes, I'm taking Lola. I don't know if you can even see that very well, but this is what it looks like. Just to give the shape that I want, I'm going to use a colored liner. This is also by Black Up. And again, the shade or the number, I do not know. I 
And then for my inner tear duct, I'm gonna go back into the Nubian palette and take that Nairobi shade again and apply this to the inner part of my lids. I'm gonna move on and come back to the eyes. I'm gonna take my under eye concealer. This is the LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Fawn. Taking it down the bridge of my nose. Gonna set those areas with the Sasha Buttercup powder. Gonna contour with the Black Up contour powder. This is number three, I think. No shade names. So I'm just gonna contour the perimeter of my forehead. I'm gonna take the Black Up Two Way Cake. I'm gonna use it as my face powder, and this is number 13. I'm just going to apply this to my face and also tone down my under eye highlight. My blush, I'm using one from Black Up, and this is number five. Gonna go back with that orange shade and apply it to my bottom lash line. Go back with that brown, the dark brown shade from the Juvia's Place palette. There was actually a Black Up pencil, a black pencil, but I can't find it. So I'm just gonna use my regular liner. For my highlight, I'm gonna use the Black Up Powder Sublime in the shade one. It's really subtle, but it just adds a nice highlight to your cheeks tip of my nose and my cupid's bow lining my lips with nyx's mahogany lip liner gonna use a milani metallic lip cream in the shade materialistic and then go over it with the ColourPop Ultra Gloss Lip in the shade Wolfie. 